Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com and I'm currently on board the unbelievable Regent Seven Seas Explorer. This is the most exclusive ship in the world and this right here is the most exclusive address at sea. You're gonna absolutely love it. It's massive, over 4,000 square feet, including the balconies. Let me show you what it's all about. All right, so right when you walk in the door, you do have a video doorbell here, so you can see who's outside. Um, and then also right at the wings of the door, you have two really amazing Picassos. There's actually six genuine Picassos on board this cruise ship, which ties into all of the elaborate decor. You can see it as soon as you walk in. My breath was taken away. I'm not gonna, not gonna even joke about that. It is a special and spectacular place. So right here is your main dining room area. Living room's gonna be over there, but right here you can have every meal served course by course if you'd like, from the specialty dining, from anything in the ship. And then of course you're gonna have your own private dining room downstairs as well. But what's so unique about this particular space is that you are looking right out the front middle of the ship. And it is, uh, frankly, a better view than what the captain even gets. You have your own navigational TV there with binoculars. Um, and then essentially you can sit here and you can take in the entire world. You've got floor to ceiling glass on all sides here. And then of course your balconies are just outside. So let's continue on through the suite. And the next space that we're gonna get to is the full bar. So this is a complete full bar setup with full bottles. As you can see behind me, of course you have the Vouv Coco ready for you as soon as you get on board. And then you have your Eli Espresso maker. Of course your butler can do any and all of this for you. Uh, but sometimes, you know, for me personally, I'll wake up, make a cup of coffee, sit out on the balcony uh, before everybody else gets up. So that's a great option to have in here as well. And then I noticed that they have the Vera water. So this is going fleet wide with Oceana and Regent. Essentially they're getting rid of all single use plastics on board the ships. So these are refilled uh, as often as you want with sparkling or still water. So I'm gonna continue on through the full bar setup. Um, and now we are in the living room. Now, one of the most unique aspects of this living room is this piano. So it's a custom Steinway. It's a Dakota Jackson um, arabesque Steinway. It is beautiful. Of course, you can have someone in here playing it for you while you're eating or uh, you know hosting friends and guests in this space. But once again, that's what this particular suite is all about. It's one of a kind, unique things that you cannot find anywhere else. So when they say it's the most exclusive address at sea, now I think you can start to see why and we haven't even gotten into the most spectacular part. So here's the full living room. Um, you can spend, you know, many, 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 many months on this ship if you want to. And so it's great to have an incredible place like this that feels just like home. So you've got the, the live orchids here. Um, you've got the massive big screen TV. And even if you're sitting on the couch, you can sit, see the TV. You can also see out the side there as well. There's a full library in here. Um, you have a ton, a ton of uh, specially curated books. And then of course, if you want games or things to do with friends, have that as well. So there is a little bit of storage in and around this area. But uh, once again, this is the main living room. So just off the main living room is what we would classify as the second bedroom. So a vast majority of cruises in this stateroom is actually two people, but it's very common to have four. So maybe two couples that are traveling together. Of course, you'll see the master suite in a minute, but this is the second bedroom. So the second bedroom has a sitting area, it has its own living room, which is perfect when you're traveling with other couples or family, so you have that complete separation flat panel TV, live orchid as well. And then I'm gonna just sneak right through here. You do have two doors that shut off completely and this is the second bedroom. Now the ship was built in 2016, so it has all of the, uh, the modern electronic touches that you would expect. They've got the speakers built into the ceiling here. You've got European, US and USB uh, ports here on the side. All the light controls are there as well. And then a ton of storage on the bedside so that you can put things away completely. You can also customize your sleep. You decide if you want it softer, firmer, whatever it is, um, make sure that you let your butler know and they will customize that for you. And then just on the other side here, as we head over, I did want to point out there's another flat panel TV here just for the bedroom. And then on the other side, you're going to have the same complement of plugs here. And then of course your pillow menu, which is incredible on Regents. Okay, so as we continue on through the second bedroom, you are gonna have your vanity area here. You've got your telephone. There's actually one in every single room. You've got a large mirror that is lit on the sides. And then of course, this very luxurious chair here so you can sit and get ready. And I do love the touch that they have plugs here as well. I always bring extra European plugs, uh, personally, because most of my electronics are US. Like this particular spot has one European plug, but if you bring a couple extras, you can utilize every single plug in the room. So now let's head into the walk-in closet. Once again, a massive space. Pointed out again, this is the second bedroom. So here you have incredibly comfortable robes that are complimentary in all the suites on board. Um, you've got your laundry and everything here, which of course is completely complimentary. And then your cashmere throws as well. They do have a large safe that is big enough for a laptop. I really appreciate that touch. 
Okay, before we head into the bathroom, I did want to point out this has a separate door. This room is never locked off and sold separately, but it's great when you're traveling with a second couple or family members, like I mentioned, to be able to have a separate entrance. This door closes off completely, so it's like its own little apartment. All right, so follow me into the bathroom. Okay, so you have a full soaking tub here, um, and along with that, you also have a, a small rainforest shower head just above. Okay, and then over here, I really, really appreciate that in both rooms, they have a separate um, shower and bathtub. So there's a rainforest shower head here. I'm a pretty tall guy, I'm 6'6". Six, six. I barely fit in here, but I do fit in. Um, and I wanted to point out that they also had the shower wand as well. By staying in this room, you have access to every single one of the upgraded bath amenity products that they have. They have several to choose from. So you have the L'Occitane over there. Um, and then you also have the Bottega Veneta here. And then I'll point out a little bit more when we get into the master bedroom. All right, so as I head out here to the main lounge area, I just wanted to talk a little bit about why people booked this particular room. So one of them is, of course, entertaining. So cruise on board, bring friends that are in other suites or even staying in here, and this is the perfect space for that. So you have a bartender here hosted just like you would any other cocktail party on the ship, but of course, this is gonna be private just for you. And then another touch that I absolutely love is right here to the left, you've got a great little guest bathroom here. So it's just a half bath, it's got the commode. Um, once again, beautiful, beautiful decor and upgraded amenities uh, all around. And then also there's even some storage area to put things away completely. But if you have guests that are staying, that are visiting you, they don't actually have to go into the guest wing, they don't have to go into the, uh, the main wing either. Uh, basically they can just enjoy this space with you and have an incredible time. All right, so now I'm headed into the master suite. I just wanted to point out that you have storage over here. It's all hanging storage and then a ton right here. This is really for coats and such, and then you can put all kinds of storage here, but let me show you the walk-in closet in just a minute. So as we head on in, now you are in the most elegant master suite ever built on a cruise ship, and it's not even close. So as soon as you come in here, you see it has its full living room and a full vanity area here as well. This is more of a study desk area. Um, you've got a flat panel TV, your Bose surround sound that is all the way around this beautiful couch here, and then of course the wood table, every single detail has been curated and taken care of. I wanted to point out that this closes completely to give you a second level, level of separation. So as you know, spouses, sometimes you want your own space, that's the perfect thing for that. Um, and then over on the bedside, you have a really, really large drawer set. So up and, up and down, you also have a European plug, US plugs and uh, USB ports on the side, and then your portable phone that you can use uh, on the ship as well. I wanted to point out this bed. Once again, the most expensive bed ever put on a cruise ship. It's a $150,000 horsehair mattress, supposed to be the best night's sleep that you can have in the entire world. So love to try that out sometime very, very soon. Right here, when I'm looking out, what you have is full views out the front of the ship, just like the captain's gonna have as well. And that's directly from your bed. Beautiful chandelier above the bed. And then of course, you've got these separate reading lights here. So you don't have to disturb your partner. And then more plugs on the side and then a ton more storage right here, and then the big drawers as well. Okay, so now I'm gonna wrap around and head into the walk-in closet. So this has two dressing areas. Um, so you have a ton of storage, unbelievable amount of storage. I think you would have a hard time filling it all up in here, um, even for a world cruise, but basically a ton of storage here, place to sit and get ready. And then if you'll follow me on, once again, more storage. This actually closes off so you can separate out the space for his and hers if you want more storage here up and down, and then another place to sit and get ready. So this is truly a masterful walk-in closet, but let me show you what makes this suite more unique than anything else ever built. Now we are heading into the master crafted master bathroom. It is unbelievable. The details are, are unlike anything I have ever seen before. So over here, you have a massive soaking tub. Of course, your butler will draw a tub for you, get that cocktail ready if that's something that you want. And then over here, you have a massive double vanity. They have all the products that they offer, basically every major beauty line you have access to. So you've got Guerlain, L'Occitane, um, and several others that you just choose and, and use what you want throughout. And then of course they have a, a gift set there with the uh, perfume that you can take with you at home. So as I continue on, you've got the remotes. There's actually a TV here in the bathtub, so you can sit, relax, and watch TV. But this is probably where you're gonna find me. So these are stone, chairs that they normally have in the most elegant spas in the world. They're heated, they're really, really good for your back, they're uh, fantastic, and of course you're looking right outside. But one unique feature about this particular room is that you get unlimited spa and beauty treatments. They'll do them either in the room or down in the salon, depending on what, you know, what makes the most sense. But once again, that is included with the ticket price of this room. I'm gonna continue on over to a couple more features that are incredibly unique. So right here is your own personal sauna. 
So once again, big enough for, for two people. Uh, awesome, nice and warm in here. But once again, beautiful, beautiful place. Something unique that you never find in a cruise ship room. And then you got this great porthole that looks directly out to the ocean. All right, so as we continue on here, I wanted to point out the shower. So this is a absolutely massive shower. It's huge. Okay, of course, marble as you would expect. I jokingly call this the car wash shower because you have all of those features here with the wand. You've got a massive rainforest shower head here. You've got speakers in here. And then of course you have three more rainforest shower heads there so you can sit and get a soak. And then this is a steam shower as well. So it functions as a, a steam room, even if you don't wanna take a shower. And then as we continue on, the last spot that I will point out is the, uh, the commode, but of course, one thing that another touch that's really great is there's a bidet in here as you would expect with a suite of this caliber but there's also a full sink inside here as well so i know husbands and wives really love having all of their own spaces in the bedroom in the bathroom and throughout a massive suite like this all right so now i'm out on the massive deck area there's over a thousand square feet of deck this is the port side you've got the, the uh, bedroom just behind me here massive day bed there two really soft and comfortable loungers. Of course, your butler will put blankets out here as you'd like. And then one thing that I love about this is as you wrap around, you get those multiple views. So from here, you get an incredible side view looking out the side of the ship. Once again, master bedroom is just behind me. And then as we continue on down here, what you have is this small plunge pool area. So as you head on in, it's enclosed. So, it, so if, if the weather's bad, it's not a big deal, but right here you have a plunge pool that you can have heated or you can just have uh, cold water in there as well, looking directly out at the beautiful ocean. And then right behind me here is the master bathroom suite for reference. All right, so now I'm headed out to the starboard side wing of the deck area. I just wanted to point out here, this is that, that area that's above the captain's lounge where you can see directly out and you have your own basically navigational bridge in here. This side is more about dining. All of your meals can be served course by course. Some of the finest cuisine at sea, it is, really is amazing food on board here. And you can have it right here with your friends and family member if you like. This looks to me like the absolute perfect place to have a nice coffee in the morning as you relax. But once again, another great feature is that this balcony wraps around completely as well. And so if you do have another couple sharing it with you, this could technically be their side, the other side is yours. And if you follow me back, what you see is you have a small seating area here with another table. Uh, and right here is the entrance to the second guest bedroom. Thank you so much for joining me today on this tour of the Regent Seven Seas Explorer Regent Suite. This exclusive address can be booked by Har Travel. We are your suite and luxury experts. We have an amazing relationship with Regent. We know the product inside and out, so we can help you create the vacation of a lifetime at an incredible value.